Hey guys, it's Heather from Caliber Plan. Today I am planning in this planner. It's kind of like an extra planner that I use um, just to show different ways to create in your planner. So it's not really um, a planner that I really use to plan. It's um, really for my YouTube channel and it's diff um, just ways to show y'all different things. It's so I guess you could say it's a fake planner. Okay guys, it's a fake planner. But I'm using it um, just to kind of show y'all different things and different ways to play. So what I'm doing today is a lot of people have asked me to show them how I decorate and then how I add pin to that decoration just so that they kind of get a better idea. Because a lot of times my spreads on here um, really just show um, the before the pin and then you kind of have to go to my Instagram account to see the after the pin. And so a lot of people have just asked that I show the after the pin. And so um, the way that I plan is I, I decorate beforehand and then I fill it out as the week goes on. So it's really hard for me to do a YouTube video in my normal planner showing after the pin because I kind of plan as I go. I plan like the day before, the day after, stuff like that. Um, but today I am going to plan, I'm gonna decorate and then I'm gonna add the pin so that you see both parts. Um, I'm gonna start with the quote sticker book and I'm just going to be decorating before the pin. And I'm going to go, I think, with a pink and um, this shade of pink and then this mint color for the decor. So I'm going to add this double box sticker here. If I can get it straight. And I'm going to start just kind of by flipping through and picking some stickers and adding them. I usually like to choose a color scheme, so I'm going with pink and this mint color. And then flip through my books to find stickers that go with my color scheme. So, that's what I'm doing now, just flipping through. And I may add in some black too. Um, maybe, you know what I may do? I may change my whole mind. I may do black and pink and gold and just let this blue kind of be like an accent color. Okay, I love this one. It says, hello Friday, I heart you. And that'll be a cute way to add in some gold. Okay, I love this little polka dot thingy my bob here. So I think I'm gonna try and fill this up. You guys know I do this all the time, right? Place a sticker and then fill it up. I love this like leopard looking polka dot. I think it's so cute. Add in some black and white. Oh, here's another one. This one's a little smaller than that one but it's still kind of the same feel. So I'm gonna put some of this here. Like that. And then I'm gonna do the other one here. Like that. All right, I'm like already obsessed with this spread. This says Weekend Warrior. You guys know I love weekend banners. It 
so there's a ton. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look, it has that same polka dot. So I'm going to put it like that. And then I may end up covering this up with something pink so that it looks more pink. Okay, this, oops, this sticker says appointment today. I don't need it to say appointment today, so I'm going to cut it, and then I'm going to just pop this like so, and then I'm going to write to do on that sticker. said there would be days like this okay so I'm done with that book now let's go to another book see if we can find some oh my goodness look it's that same sticker but it's pink dang it I wish I'd use that oh well too late now don't you hate that when you find like the perfect sticker but you've already put stickers down it's the worst so I love to use these little check things to write um, like things to do Also, I'm using the pink student book now, in case you're wondering. Sorry, I'm trying to be better about saying what book I'm using, but I'm not always good at remembering. just flipping through. I really would like some more little icons here. Oh, I love that one. I don't know if I have anywhere. I don't really have anywhere for that to go, but I really like the black and white stripes. Okay, just put it back in the book. Use it another time. Okay, here is a pink coffee mug. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use my Tombow eraser and cover up this coffee mug that's here. And I know that's a little over the top, but when I'm going with a color scheme, I really like to do my best to stick to that color scheme. And so I just think that this coffee mug is going to look a little bit better with my color scheme. See, I already love it so much more. And while that's still blue, it's just not as obvious. Um, 
so I really like that a lot more. Just a cute little way trick to make um, your stickers work for you. Just play around with them. Okay. Let's put some of these. No, that's not, those actually aren't coming off the page. Okay, I'm almost done because I know that y'all are probably like, oh my gosh, I gotta hurry up. If I put this here, is that too many? like it here but that may be too many boxes oh so indecisive sometimes let's put that back I feel like I really need something here and here I'm almost done. If I could just find some icons. Little, so let's go to the rainbow book. To the pink section. Okay. Let's just put some icons down. This right here might be like my favorite thing ever. Okay, and then I love this box right here because that really helps to tie in that print. And then we're gonna take um, this Aaron's box. Okay, so now we have done the, the decorating. And this is pretty typical. You've probably seen me decorate like this a million times. But now I'm gonna take a pen and I'm gonna do um, an after the pen spread just to kind of show you guys how I fill it in because a lot of you guys ask me how I fill it in. So I have two pens. They're both Papermate flares. I have black and pink. Um, just the pink will just be to add some fun um, accent colors so I'm going to start over here with where it says drink the coffee do the things because this is going to be a great place um, just to list I'm going to list because we just got home from vacation so I'm added three check boxes and I'm going to write in some things that I need to do around the house um, just after getting back from vacation. Okay, so that's just three things and I usually try to tie it in um, with whatever I'm like whatever the sticker says. So it says drink the coffee, do the thing. So these are things that I need to do. 
Um, up here, I'm going to put pool day. And just make that pool. I like to make the pool kind of stand out a little bit more. So that's just a big thing that's going to happen on Monday. So that's just a fun way to cover, color that in. Then on the make it happen, these are going to be things, other things that I need to do um, that are a little bit different from these things here. Now it does, as you can see, the box kind of bleeds into Tuesday a little bit. So here I would write things that I need to do on both Monday and Tuesday. So um, I need to meal plan. And I'm writing with a black pen because it's on the pink paper. That's kind of how I'm choosing what color. So I need a meal plan. I need to go to Aldi. I need to go to Target. I need to go to Belk. And I need to go to Hobby Lobby. So those are just other things that I need to do. Now, here since I wrote in black, next to what I'm going to write in pink. And I put this little glass, pair of glasses, um, because I need to make an eye appointment. So I'm going to put um, call and make an eye appointment for August. Okay, and then I wrote August in this little script just to kind of, I usually like to have a word stand out a little bit. I think it just makes it look a little more decorative. And then I'm just taking my marker and going back and bolding the down strokes. Okay, then down here, important. These are gonna be other things that I need to do. So I'm gonna say um, 10 o'clock style session, 11 o'clock, um, Nicole comes to shop, okay? All right, now I will also say that I'm kind of writing a little faster than I normally do, um, so I feel like my handwriting's not as cute as it normally is. Normally I kind of take a little more time writing, but I'm trying to make this video not be like 45 minutes long. So I am writing a little bit faster um, than I normally would. So on Wednesday, I'm gonna go back to my black pen because I did black, pink, black. Um, and on Wednesday, I'm gonna put ship purchases and then I'm going to make a little note to go to the post office and then underneath something else I might need to do is this is fake planning kind of I mean these are actually things that are going on in my life this week but I'm trying to like come up with things to just kind of show you how to fill it in um what is something else I'm gonna to have to do Wednesday Okay, and then errands, um, I need to go to, let's say two errands, and let's write them in pink again, just to add some more pink in here. Actually, I'm no, I'm going to stick with black because the pink will clash with that shade of pink right there. So I'm going to say my errands, I need to go to Target, and I need to go to Costco. I really need to go to Costco. I have like a long list of things to buy at Costco. Now here, since I wrote with black, I'm gonna go back to pink. And I'm gonna put, we have a sale on Wednesday night. We're gonna do an all about Amelia sale. 
in my LuLaRoe page. So then this page is pretty much done. I don't, because I feel like if I write anything here, it's gonna look kind of crowded. So I'm gonna leave that page as is. Okay, and then over here, we're gonna do something similar. So I'm gonna write to do I need to do some laundry. I probably need to clean the pool again. We have a ton of trees around our pool, so I have to vacuum it pretty often. Um, and then I'm probably going to need to ship. I ship pretty regularly because we saw a lot of little row. So if you notice, I did black, blank, black, blank, black. So I'm going to go back with pink. Um, and I'm going to put bedroom. I need to clean my bedroom really bad. Um, I need to clean the kitchen. And I need to mop. Okay. Make things happen. Okay. Then here, we always go on a date night on Friday nights. And I'm really excited about this one because we haven't been on a date night since before our vacation. Um, which I, we were together a lot on vacation, but every night we went out to eat with other people. And so I'm just really excited to have a night with my husband on Friday. So date night. Up here, I'm gonna make a note about church. 8.30 and then right here I'm going to make a note about lunch okay um, here I'm going to put Costco um, we need plates, waters, mm, and toilet paper, so TP. Then here I'm gonna put torchies because I am making Matthew take me to torchies on Saturday. And we're also gonna go get pops. We're gonna have a day date Saturday, I just decided. Okay, then here I'm gonna say we're gonna spend Saturday cleaning okay now I'm gonna leave these blank because I don't really know what else I need to put there right now um, but that is something I could fill in later too so that's just an example of how I fill in my planner after the like after the pen once I decorate it. I know a lot of you guys have been interested in how I do that. So that's just a quick run through. Again, this is um, a planner that I'm going to be using just to do spreads for my YouTube channel. Um, so, but it is real. Like all of those things are things that we need to do. So it's just an example of how I fill it in. Um, I hope that maybe this helps you guys a little bit. Um, if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button so that I know that you want to see more videos like this. Um, and if you do want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button so that you can check out the rest of them. And happy planning!